When within visual range of enemy aircraft, it is time to transition from beyond visual range radar scan mode to one of the close air combat modes. These will be necessary when in a dogfight. First, press 3 to enter the vertical scan mode. Great. Now go ahead and press I to turn on the radar. In this mode, the radar will search in a vertical scan pattern between the two vertical bars on the HUD. The radar will lock onto a target in the vertical plane when the target is between the two bars, is within 10 kilometers, and you press enter. This is a useful mode when in a turn fight and the target is just above your nose. Press 4 to enter boresight mode. Boresight mode is indicated by the circle on the HUD. When you place a target in the circle, the target is within 10 kilometers and you press enter, the target will be locked up. This is handy when you want to visually lock up a target when there are several in view. Press 5 to enable the helmet mounted sight. The helmet mounted sight, or HMS, places a monocle over one of your eyes. By moving your view, you can place a sight projected on a monocle over a target and locking it up by pressing enter. When using the R-73 dogfight missile, this is an amazing tool for locking up a target far outside your HUD and engaging it. When the target is locked and within launch parameters, the HMS reticle will flash. If there is an exo of the HMS reticle, it indicates the HMS is too far outside of the constraints for a valid missile launch. Press 6 to enter longitudinal missile aiming mode. This last mode does not use any of the aircraft sensors, but rather only uses the infrared seeker in the R-73 and R-2017 series of missiles. Simply select one of these missiles and place the cross in the center of the HUD over a target and launch the missile when you hear the lock tone. When you are ready, press the spacebar to turn off active pause and practice these modes against several target aircraft in the area. You can end the mission when done.